Hi, I'm Dave. And I'm Wally. What are we doing today, Wally? Well, Dave, today we're going to talk about PVC. We have several videos out there going over TPO, and we're going to dedicate a little more time to some PVC today on this. Perfect, perfect. What thicknesses do we have in our PVC line? We have 50, 60, and 80 in both standard PVC and... XK. Right. Correct. So 50, 60 mil are, you know, kind of readily used throughout the industry, but we're starting to see an uptick in guys using 80 mil. A lot more specifying so, and then for 80. There's yeah. some considerations that need to be, I mean, because you've welded 60 mil, you've never welded 80 mil. There's things you need to really step back and take and think about. Absolutely. I mean, 80 mil is thicker. It takes heat different. It takes weight different. Right. I mean, there's everything that you do for every other one, you have to do for 80 mil. Set up on 50, set up on 60, and set up on 80. Does it necessarily require more heat? Not necessarily. Again, it all depends on the ambient temperature, right? Right, right. So, you know, sometimes you might have to slow down. Yes. And then maybe more heat, maybe less heat. And this is why we do test welds, right? Right, and then, of course, there's airflow, too. Yeah, the airflow's got a lot to do with it. Right. The weights on the machine. Right. Like TPO, sometimes we don't need all the weight. Correct. On PVC, you probably want all the weight. Because what are we looking for when we weld PVC? Oh, bleed out and smoke, And of smoke, so yeah. That's a telltale sign of, of PVC. Does that mean you're getting a good weld? No. Because you can overheat PVC just like you can TPO. It's easily done. But again, it can't stress enough, set up by the ambient temperature, mm -hmm. and got to do those test welds. Got to do test welds. And, and getting back to the, you know, we're seeing more and more 80 mil getting into the market, the guys really need to pay attention to these these settings when they're, when they're welding this, this type of membrane. Yeah, if you're if you're welding 50 and go to 80, yeah. it's a totally different setup. Total different ball game yep. on that. So stay tuned for the next videos. We're actually gonna get into the weeds of welding the membrane and different systems and warranties and all that stuff, correct? Perfect. 